Hey guys, um, I just wanted to do a quick video to explain the importance of having a good breast pump and good section. Um, so this is baby number four. Um, I have a seven year old, twins that are four and a half, and a three month old now. Um, none of them ever latched. I always had problems. I know it's TMI, but I think my nipples were too big or something, but I've only exclusively breast pumped for all four of them until they were six months old. So I actually have been very gotten very used to the breast pump. So the first thing I always check when I notice my milk production is a little bit low is the membranes. I have a Medela breast pump and the membranes is that little white flappy part that attaches to the I'll uh <laughs> make a video later to show you what I'm talking about. But anyways, um, because the membranes is what creates the suction. If you don't have proper suction, then you're not going to have great milk production. So, hey, that rhymes. <laughs> proper suction, great milk production. Anyways, <laughs> um, so the reason why I'm saying this is I've, I've always known that a great pump, great suction equals great milk production so this morning I was pumping and because I don't pump all night in the mornings I normally get about 16 ounces um, and I was pumping this morning and I t pump usually for about 20 minutes I only had about three minutes left and I look down and I only had four ounces from each side and I'm like what the heck I was get way more than this so then of course I start freaking out like oh my gosh is my milk supply going away whatnot and I look over at my breast pump and I realize it's on the lowest setting possible and I'm like oh my gosh that's why so I kick it back up to where I normally pump at and boom my the milk starts flowing I ended up pumping for like 30 minutes but I did get about 17 ounces so it made me realize it dawned on me like what if all these women out there having problems really it's not even them it's probably their machine or just um the suction not being turned up enough so my biggest advice is besides having a good machine make sure that you have the suction um to where it's a little uh, uncomfortable. You want it to be bearable because you don't want to be in pain because if you're in pain, you're going to be, uh, not having great milk production. So, uh, make it to where it's just slightly uncomfortable. Um, and then also make sure you have a great breast pump that, because it might not be you, it might be the pump, it might be the suction. So anyways, just wanted to put it out there. Have great pump, have great suction, equals great milk production. Anyways, talk to you guys later.